what am I doing? So a while ago in the thread, I was talking about some pictures that I drew in class and stuff. And you guys were like, oh, I want to see them, but I didn't have them last week. I still don't actually have them. I redrew them, though, so that I have a version of them. There's this one. This is Harry Potter riding a dinosaur in Narnia. This is a picture of Harry Potter fighting Voldemort and where their wands clash. There's a rip in time and space and a bunch of awesome stuff is falling out. There's a ninja and a pirate and a zombie and a unicorn and a dinosaur and a laser gun and a robot and a mustache and the TARDIS and a squid and another mustache. A and a third mustache. Oh, I'm on fire! The mysterious flaming unicorn. It's like a regular unicorn, but on fire. In other news, there's recently been even more awesome coming from the threads. Yes, that's right. Threads. There's more than one. So we've been planning stuff. Some big stuff that eventually you will see, but for now I can't really tell you anything. Tomorrow, though, we will be discussing many of these stuffs via Skype. All at the same time. Ah! I'm supposed to tell you who my favorite YouTuber is who has less than a thousand subscribers. I don't really subscribe to a whole lot of people. I mean, I do, but I don't, and I do, but I don't. I don't know. So I went and I looked at all the people that I subscribe to, and I'm like, oh yeah, that's a great channel. No, they're way too famous. Oh, that's a good channel. No. No, they're, they're famous too. I don't know. I don't know what you want me to say. I'm gonna pick, um, um, what about Ask a Ninja? He's my cousin, you know. He's a pretty good guy. The Closet Ninja says I should pick Ask a Ninja because, well, you know, they're cousins. Mostly because if I don't, it might kill me. I do like Ask a Ninja. Ask a Ninja cracks me up. I mean, I have the book and everything. I'm a nerd. <laughs> on with this book. I'm on, according to my notes, I haven't talked about chapter six, journey from platform nine and three quarters. Basically, Harry gets dropped off at a train station and the Dursleys say, ha, good luck. But he finds the Weasleys, which is great because I love the Weasleys. So I'm looking at my notes, and my notes say this. Chapter 6, Journey from Platform 9 and 3 quarters. Weasleys. Train. Candy. Scabbers. Hermione. Names. Malfoy. <laughs> Thanks, past self. You left really great notes. <laughs> I put the word train inside a box of importantness, and I don't know what I was meaning. So Harry gets on the train. We learn about chocolate frogs. I had a chocolate frog once. Look, I still have the card. It's Rowena Ravenclaw. Coincidence? I think not. Rowena Ravenclaw, co-founder of Hogwarts. Rowena Ravenclaw helped create Hogwarts and gave her name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. It's thought that she came up with the ever-changing floor plan. She's best remembered for her intelligence and creativity. I have no further comments. I can has high five. One, two, three. Pew. Random object of the week. This squirrel. I can't close the door.